Hello, and welcome back to Morbid Curiosity. We uh, have just finished robbing the, uh, well, breaking into the police, as it were, station, robbing the whole place. Um, which means, uh, considering I knocked out all the guards, means I can wander the streets without fuss because the tourists don't care. Well, at least the streets in this little section of town. Who? What? Oh, there's an archer up there. He doesn't like me. Sorry, mate. But he can't get me either. Which is uh, odd to put a bit archer in a high position where they can't shoot. Is yeah, 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 yeah. So this gate, I don't have to climb over. This gate, I can just unlock. Which takes me further east, which is good because um, well, there's a few places here I still kind of want to explore. I do need to check out the gallery, I suppose. Right now, my goal is to get to the smuggler's place in the pawn shop since they're in our actual objectives. I suppose the pawn shop is supposed to give me more loot or something. Just wait till I find you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm wondering about other guards patrolling this. There's one, two. So they somehow know me on sight, so they're they're a hazard. You can't hide for long. Wait, I've, are you going through the gate now that I've unlocked it? Hmm. No. Pretty dark in the gateway, actually. I don't think anyone's gonna see you there. So I think that archer has stopped looking for me. Oh, that's not wood. Is it? Can't tell. Let's do the. Uh... There it is. It's weird. It's kind of got a wood texture, but the pieces look. Far too large. Oh, they're patrolling. Okay, that's not good. I won't be able to deal with it after. I'll just leave them alone. How about that? Nobody's going to mind me picking this lock, are they? Butcher's house. Uh, yes, yes, very, uh, a pig cutting itself into salami. Yes, that's exactly how it works. Sausages. Succulent baric steaks. Oh, this is all good. Um, yeah. Oh, somebody around. All right, stop fooling around. I think he got away. What? Do I have any flash bombs? I have. How did you oh. get in here? Are you the archer from up above the gate? You just followed me in here. Or were you patrolling the streets and followed me in here? I'm very confused. Well, let's have some uh, tricks on a spit. I think you uh, ate all, broke in, ate all the food, and uh, collapsed from, from it all. No, it's not the one from there. It must have been someone on the streets that saw me. Careless, Garrett, careless. But really, I couldn't care less. Ho ho ho. That sounds more like a barrack than a pig. I mean, a pig than a barrack. Oh, that opened the barrack pen. Hmm. It doesn't feel like a safe place to be hanging around a lot of barracks. Come on, that was nothing. Why is everyone in this mission set to get alert when, on high alert when they 
torch splashes out. Well, problem solved, I suppose. Hoping to use the lack of light to sneak up on you and do that, but, uh... Or to sneak past you. But that works. Oh, there is a guard. He is, uh... Very on edge. Oh, no, it's a thief. That's why he's walking so fast. Okay, so I did all that to get to the store, and this isn't even a door. It's got a handle and everything. But it's not a door. Why do I want to go to the barrack pen, then, if... Oh well. My eyes must be playing tricks on me. Yeah, they'll do that. I'm getting too jumpy. You're getting way too jumpy, mate. Let's stop that. I'll fix that for you. Alright. I don't know what's going on there. That's not a door. You guys trying to break in somewhere you shouldn't? I guess you came here on the boat. Can I break in there? Oh no, it's not a door, so that's just pointless colour. Alright. Um, so there wasn't really any purpose in coming down here or in this at all? Right? Wait, I've got a, I've got a sword now. I mean, it's. It's a door object and everything, but it's uh, not actually, it's not breakable. It's probably uh, nothing behind it but solid wall. Um, I mean, I could go swimming. Which would take me further west, which I don't even know if I want to go further west. But maybe this is a direction I could have come before. Or maybe it'll take me to new areas with... Magic spells. Feels like it's gonna be bad if I step there. That's not a door. Hmm. These I can break. Here, book, blood. Strange noises. I was gonna say more sausages, but no, it looks it's perhaps intestines. Booksellers key. Oh, so this is how we get to the booksellers. Conveniently brings us right to the safe. It's not very safe to have your safe in the same room as a trapdoor to the canals. So, were those thieves with the boat the ones responsible for uh, the mess we saw? Well, I'm sorry, City Watch, you won't be make getting this uh, contribution to your pension fund. I'm expecting a shipment today for some books that are sure to sell right off the shelves. I even managed to get them for half the usual price. It seems to be my lucky day. Okay, I would uh, question your conclusion there, but um, as uh, other indications suggest otherwise. But, uh, I've heard groans, but is there anything else in here after all? I guess not, that was just the, uh, the crime scene down below. Alright, well we can get in here whenever we want now. And uh, since I've made a note of that, locked crime scene house near in and the safe, we've done that. Been in here. I'm sure that can't be all right. Like, what were they murdered for? There was no person didn't even take the money. 
Is there any other mysteries going on? There's no clues to any, but... Uh... Maybe it's just part and parcel of all the uh, violence that happens in this dreadful town, you know? Oh, hey. That uh, looks awfully like the uh, Folio Society edition of The Hobbit, which I have on my shelf. I'm pretty sure it is. I don't know if you actually read the title there. Not quite, but uh, it's certainly consistent with it being that, and there's uh, the dragon on the front. What about these other books? I don't recognize any of those. It's a great thing about low, low risk textures is you can put, you know, actual things in and not be distracted by being able to read the titles. And, and be taken out of world because obviously the Hobbit doesn't exist in the world of Thief. So it can't possibly be the Hobbit, it must be... Oh, it's the tale, it's the Burrick. And the picture on the front is a Burrick breathing gas, yes, of course. Nothing to do with dragons and... and Hobbits, whatever they are supposed to be. Alright, so... Okay, that's the booksellers. I still don't... Quite get what is really supposed to be happening here. I'm going to try stepping into this. It's probably going to be bad, right? No. There's nothing. All right. Well, let's carry on. See where else is canals take us. Perhaps even to this area we actually started in. Well, identical little. Passageway. Another spell circle. What is going on in here? I mean, why have a spell circle if it doesn't... I mean, the other one maybe was set off by the bookseller and that's how he died. Oh, is that a rotting ghost corpse? Hmm. Something is wrong here. Wherever here is. Hell. Well, that's not working, is it? Hmm. Hmm. Should this thing come in here or what? I just have to play this one really patiently. Or is it coming to seep me out regardless? Kill the beast! I tried, it seemed to uh, not react to my sword at all. Of course I heard the bloody torch go out and thought that was suspicious. Because, of course, everyone in this town... Well, there is something there, but... Uh... Saw me, whatever it was. How do I deal with that? Kill it with sausages. Flash bomb might work, but it seems unlikely. I mean, it works for undead, but was that undead or was it just.
You have earned your sword. What? What the hell? That was all my flash bombs. Why does that mean I've earned my sword? I don't get it. What's my sword got to do with this? Oh, there's another victim. Had some loot. Not happy about having spent all my fl flash bombs there, but I can maybe do without them. I'm good at running and hiding, generally. But, um... This whole putting out torches thing is, uh... Alerting people is very frustrating because the whole point of putting out a torch is so you can get by without alerting people, and... You know, if you're gonna put someone into second alert because you put out a torch, then... Oh, what? Oh, thank you. Uh, if you're gonna put someone into second alert because you put out a torch, then... You might as well run past them and... When you may not even risk putting them into second, but just first alert, you know? It kind of breaks the gameplay. Alright, let's keep, keep searching these canals. Oh, that's the bookseller's again. Oops, I'm going the wrong way. Well, I have no idea what that was all about, but maybe that was the thing that killed the bookseller? I don't understand what the spells were about. Hello, this bridge. Do we have a bridge on the map? Yeah, there's a bridge on the map. Okay, so that brings us out here. That's good to know. That's, uh... Gets to the market and the gallery, and I guess that's the gate that I picked anyway, because it was close to the market. Oh. Saw so this and it saw... So, oh, well, that's a way in, because there's a door with a handle, but no, it's not a way in. It's a door with a handle that doesn't work. Oh, there's a current to this river, too. And there's... Um, basically a billion guards around. I have no idea where it's dark and where it's light because everything's the same pale grey right now. We can't mantle out for some reason. So maybe I don't come this way at all. Let's just go back. If I can't climb out, then uh, it seems kind of pointless to be in the water there. The geometry of the edge there was, uh, there was a small ledge before the actual wall and that small ledge wasn't big enough for me to mantle on and the wall was too high, well, whether the wall was too high or not, it just breaks the mantle, so I can't, so I can't get out there, which is unfortunate. But, um, let's just go back to the way we came, which was uh, through the butchers, which is in the market anyway, so. This will take us to the same part of town pretty quickly. Although that's further north, I guess, than we are here. But God, it's so it's just so bright everywhere. Like here, it doesn't look like pitch dark, and here it doesn't look like really bright. It's I'm finding it very frustrating trying to trying to sneak anywhere. Which is why I'm basically knocking out all the guards, because uh, they do see me sooner or later. Ladies dressmaker. Well, and tea maker apparently. Oh, there's another door. I thought, is that the whole room? Anything hiding behind the screen? Nope. Not even another thief like me. Uh, Alright, sewing machine and... Valuable golden sewing kit. Alright. Oh, a gold thimble. Why, why would you have a gold thimble like you? It's just decadent. We use gold needles as well. Where's your gold thread? 
I mean, gold thread at least goes into the final product that you're selling. Your gold thimble is really just showing off. And besides, thimbles are so easily lost. It seems not just uh, needless, but quite likely careless. Never mind. Let the dressmaker choose whatever uh, things they want. I won't mind. It's their business, their money to spend. Mine to steal. I guess I should be glad they go in for such things like uh, gold thimbles. Seeing as I can sell it. Look at those. Metal on the ground. Sorry, so that's the area with the bridge and a lot of guards. Maybe it's a bad idea unlocking the gates, because if people start to chase me, then... Yeah, maybe I shouldn't run around with a weapon out. If people start to chase me, that means then... Uh, the guards can chase me through the open gates. The Gab Examiner, Daily News. Oh, I can't pick the lock. There surely must be another way in. There's a pipe. Need to go from roof to roof. But, uh, it's not immediately obvious how that would help. Grimaldi. Greatness, grandiose, garbage, Grimaldi, the gallery. Right, that explains the Salvador Dali posters. It's uh, not Dali, it's uh, Grimaldi. Someone completely different. Am I still kind of heading east? No, I'm heading south now. Who? You know I'll eventually find you, so why don't you just come on out? Who are you? You shouldn't let me see you! You're done for! Well, you don't seem to be able to open the gate, and for some reason you're intensely hostile to me when no one else but the guards are. Alright, you asked for it. Look here, Golden Helm. Please ask for assistance to view. Oh, that's a very nice disp display case. Um, I will have to ask for assistance. Armourers. And they'll have a Golden Helm for me to see, if nothing else. Oh, well, thank you for the assistance, Mr. Switch. Or was that the blacksmith there that was trying to get me? Well, the armor right here. I suppose if you're, you know, you're a step above a blacksmith. Yeah, another door that's not a door. On that one, that's the same. So tight in here. Well, I've got a healing potion. It's fine. Oh, very nice fire crystals. Well, one of those against the. Oh, this lever works. But the other ones didn't. I don't know why. Fire crystals might have been nice against that weird bug ghost. Perhaps. Or maybe they just would have gone right through. Who can say? We've even got molds, but we can't pick them up. Alright. Well, it's a blacksmith. I don't actually think we need this open, so... Just close it behind us. Where to now? Uh, the smith isn't marked. I guess we keep going east to see if we can find the pawn shop. Or the smuggler. See what happens to find first. How are you, huh? Anything helps. Uh, Alright, well... Yeah. Whoops. Let me put it in the box. Have some sausages. I'm There's some sausages right there. It's not like I need them. Yeah, have some steak as well. Have all my food. 
You can eat this, you know. Bread? Maybe maybe you maybe you're vegetarians. Maybe you maybe you're offended by me offering you meat. I uh, have some bread. <laughs> no? Uh see that too then. Okay. Sorry, I don't have any uh veggies or anything. I've got the fruit, I suppose, but that's the fruit is healing points. I need the fruit. Where am I going? Round in circles. Okay, well that's just that didn't get me anywhere unless there's somewhere else I could have gone that I didn't notice. No, just a big fence. Oh wait, is this private property that we should not enter? But we will. the door. Hello. My eyes must be playing tricks on me. Maybe this is the smuggler's hideout. sounds in here or is that music can't really tell oh mate rat noise says kill me a rat with you that's what you get Wash tub and washboard and plunger. Speaking of plungers, I could take a plunger in there. Guess I might have to shortly. Oh, this one's got a rope. This one's got a way up. Well, let's finish checking out what's on this floor first. Or who. Yeah, I guess that's music, not uh, sound effects of something going on. That so where does this go? Somewhere where I need a key, and it's probably not one of the keys I've already got. And he didn't have a key. Oh, I could break it. Sure, I don't hear anyone on the other side. Oh well, or maybe they've made it not breakable despite it being a wooden door. that. Breaking down doors is half the fun. Not everything should need a key. Oh wow, okay, that didn't work. So what is down here? Underwater passage. Aha, okay. Check that out in just a second. Let's get our breath back. So where does this take us? It goes north. I mean, if these are smugglers, then this is a good way to smuggle stuff, but usually, at least smuggling around the city isn't probably helpful. Hello. something right uh, if I was in a bad mood I would be throwing you in there but I'm not you, you get to live so, I mean the music and stuff is changing very very rapidly very strange hmm. what 
There was just nothing. Is there someone up there? <clears throat> oh, nothing behind that. Oh, that's a lift. Let's make it nice and dark at the top. Because there is somebody up there. Where do I see those buttons? Oh no, let's go up, up, up. Maybe there's somebody down below and they saw me through the lift. Or maybe they just heard something. Oh, that's machinery sound, but I'm not sure where the machinery is and why it tails off so suddenly. Well, that was a waste of two water arrows. So where was that person making the sounds then? I thought they were up on one side or the other here. Guess it must be on the bottom floor. Unless there's somewhere around here. Are you heading this way, man? No, footsteps are going away again. I think we've found the smuggler's place, given all the uh, loot stashed away in various chests. Oh. Who am I hearing, then? That's not a hallway. That's not a door, is it? I'm not sure it is. thought I saw something. Oh. Looks like it's peaceful again. Even more now. You call all this clanking peaceful? Alright, so I wonder how they open it from this side. Surely they've got to have a switch somewhere. Ah, yes. Steps up above looks metal. Oh, yeah, I recognize this place. That's where, where we broke in. Okay, Point of coming in here? Can't get up any higher. You should shut your gates properly. Alright, I can get up here, okay. Just wondering about the clanking, whether it's just right here or not. I mean, it could have been. Apparently not. I think I should wait till they go. Some moss. It's not dark at all. Oh, it's dark here. Eh? Somehow. That was a waste of moss. I was going to hide in the dark and then rush out behind them, but it's not dark enough. I'll wait here and. Ambush. Hey, what the? Oh, 
God damn. That'll do. Don't even have any flash bombs. Can't, can't you just... No, of course, I'm, I'm, we're still thinking in Thief 1 jump. I was like, how can I only jump, like, a foot? It's not Thief 1, it's Thief 2. We don't have the nice leap anymore. Oh, I could have come in here as well. Okay, that's... So, some of these open and some of them don't. And I can't tell unless I walk right up to them. It's like that one doesn't. It's the same texture. Alright. Never mind. I can deal with these people if I'm not bothered about stealth. It's fine. It's fine. What's this note? Oh, I can't even read it. It's important it's being stabbed into the desk with a knife. But, uh, clearly not for me. Nice blueprints, though. Fancy desk. There's really nothing in here. Safe behind one of those, maybe. Could I switch hidden on your desk, perhaps? No. Ah, switch hidden there. That's more like it. No, it's not even a safe. It's just, just piles of loot. And a book. Every dumb cutthroat with a robot has decided to become a smuggler lately. They have no interest whatsoever in the art of this trade. I need some time off. I'll spend the evening relaxing at the Taffer Inn tonight. I caught a glimpse of that lovely fence Peyton at the inn yesterday. I wonder if she's a regular there. I'll send some men to follow her and find out where she goes. With enough ale in my blood, I may work up the courage to finally introduce myself. Alright, so that is... I didn't hear what you said, Garrett. That is why the smuggler's been following Peyton. It's uh, less suspicious than uh, one might have thought. God, these rooms are so narrow. I don't know how you could ever... Well, I guess this guy was just standing here looking out the window. This trolling guy on this metal. Yeah, I suppose if you were generous with the use of the few moss arrows you had. Door with a handle, it doesn't open. Um, you know, profligate with your moss arrows. Then you could get past it quite easily. That one also doesn't open. Alright, where's the way out? Through here. Let's close it again. Uh, you know, the secret is safe with me. Oh, there is a downstairs too. Which I think there is someone there. Hmm. I saw something. <laughs> Bloody torches getting in the way. Oh, they got another secret door here. Does this one lead to the market? Eastern end of the market. I see. And this one probably does. Oh, it does have a switch on this side. So that's the main way in and out. All right. Anything else down here? Danger! Do not touch. What? Oh, I see. To say that's like lift controls? It's like. In case somebody does come in here, they just like. have them hidden so that it's not clear that it's a lift. Yeah, I guess it does kind of just look like that. If you ignore the uh, shaft, it just looks like the roof. Fair enough. That's good. You know, I always. I didn't come in this way, so it's quite obvious, but. Um, 
having, uh, you know, someone, playful kid does discover this, finds the room here and doesn't get scared off by the guards, then they're probably not going to find the way to what's really going on. Always hide your secrets behind another secret, if you want to keep them really secret. What's in there? Oh, I can go through. I did not think I would fit. Paperwork, well that's exciting. That's a desk. Editor's key. Oh, this is the newspaper office. What is the editor's key open? Actually open. Oh, I just this gate here that I couldn't open before. Okay. Oh yeah, they got a printing press and all. All right. Well, um, then I guess that's the smuggler's way. So we need to head north-ish to the pawn shop. Try out for guards. Hello, this is a familiar looking uh, corner. Somebody walking with purpose. First of all, cast right cures and removals. Removals of what? Appendages, unwanted limbs. Cures and services: vapors, five coppers. Evil eye, ten gold. Milk leg, five coppers. Thrumps, five coppers. Warts and pustules, twenty gold. Tooth and limb removal. Price varies by girth and tolerance for pain. Is it? Is it, uh, I guess he's charging by the inch for soaring, but, um, is it cheaper if, if you got a higher pain tolerance or does it make it more expensive? You know, is he charging you for painkillers or is he charging you for the, for the, uh, inconvenience that your screams cause him? I'm not going to wait around to become one of his patients to find out. That would not... Garage lost an eye already. I don't know about this timeline, but those hemorrhoids are full of more hot air than usual, and I'm completely sold out of my miracle tonic. Thank goodness too, because I needed the gold to purchase more ether. I had the most horrible dream. I dreamt the tailor came in for a ward removal, and I accidentally removed his entire arm. He died of either blood loss or from the powerful fumes of the ether. I'm not sure which. I've been taking the ether for so long, I can't tell what is real. I'm afraid to look downstairs. If only I could find something else to cure these headaches. That quack psychic has been peddling some willow tree magic pills, but I refuse to fall for such a ruse. The books say that ether is the only known cure other than boiling one's head in goose grease, which doesn't sound pleasant. Oh, what? There's a cup I can interact with. Hmm. I guess I can put something in his cup. Breath potion. Two breath potions. Ah, and I'm stuck. Alright. Well, I don't know what I would put in his cup. Ether, perhaps. But, uh, well, goose grease. <laughs> uh, it seems like a bonus objective, perhaps. I was going to knock him out to shut up his, you know, his snoring. Come on, Garrick, don't. Maybe I'm crouching. I can get down there. I was walking forward, hitting the trap door, and not able to get far enough forward to get onto the actual ladder. It's not very convenient. All right, um... Is he the only person in this building? 
Oh, I can actually get through. I can actually get through. This takes me well further north. Ah, oh, there's pawn shop. Okay, so let's make a note. Cup at doctor's near pawn shop. I don't know if I can do anything there. I don't know if I'll find whatever I need. Um, let's just continue. But what was I supposed to be doing here? Why am I breaking in here? I thought I was supposed to be trading with this fellow. I guess he's not open. Well, maybe instead of selling him some things, I'll be uh, acquiring them. Oh, that's a nice, very uh, modernist chess set. Can't see the top shelves without jumping, and I don't want to make noise just yet. A wobbly telescope. I'm making a statue, so it's got to be uh, post thief one. This is post thief two. So talking about hammerites again being a nuisance. Hello, Mr. Garrett. Peyton said you would be dropping by, and I think we can help each other. Please excuse me for not meeting with you in person, but I'm very cautious when doing business with new associates. Because of the lockdown, my usual careers are useless to me. I need someone with your skills who knows how to avoid detection. Ha! <laughs> you haven't seen me uh, with the scouts on the street, have you? Take the parcels in the cupboard and put them in the mailbox for each recipient. These deliveries are of the utmost importance and sensitivity. If you accept this task, I will make it worth your while. Return here when you are done. Regards, the pawnbroker. New objectives. All right, help the pawnbroker. And uh, in the cupboard, you say, oh, these. Parcels of the pottery shop, the spell shop, the dairy, the machinist, the dressmaker, and the news editor. Okay. Well, I've been to a bunch of those places. Uh, does it matter that I... If I knocked anyone out there or not, I guess no one's around. I can try jumping. No, I can't jump. Why can't I jump? I don't know why I couldn't jump. Just getting stuck under something. Um, yeah, look on the chessboard. It's a pawn shop, so he has pawns. <laughs> All right. Um, what are our main objectives? Return to my room at the end. All right, let's let's do those as we come by them and some swing back to the places we've already been, like the dressmaker and and such. Oh, that's how I got in here. The dressmaker and such uh, on the way back. Don't turn around, man. Don't turn around. Good, good. Right, you stay oblivious. I'll probably knock you out though, because my uh, if you don't get stuck on that fountain, you are getting stuck on that fountain. You know, it's very inconvenient for me. Let's try and get you unstuck. Given uh, my proclivity for avoiding the gas successfully this night. I will uh, knock you out just to make the place safer for me. Someone making noise. I hope not. It would uh, disturb you if somebody was making noise. Why don't you just uh, chill in that alcove? Right, so we've hit another fountain. Which is also marked on the map, right? That's got to be this one. So I guess... Apart from the delivery of these parcels... Pottery... What are they for? Let's just double check. Parcels of pottery shop, okay. Spell shop, we... Uh, have we been to the spell shop? No, I went to the... Oh, hello. I don't know, but uh, it wasn't good. It wasn't me. Did I find the spell shop or did I only find the uh, 
places to load plants and fruit. Dairy I have not found. Dressmaker we've been to. News editor we've been to. Machinist I'm not sure. Like we went to the armorist, armorer, but I don't think that's the machinist. Oh well, we've got a password for the pottery shop, and the door doesn't open, so we've got to find a way, a different way in. Uh, it doesn't look like he's got any windows that can open either. Do I just drop it on his doorstep? No, I can't drop it. Put it in. His oh, he's got a mailbox. All right. One down. Mailbox makes it much easier. Maiden of the North. That must be the bell at the Hammerite place. And here comes the guard. Oh shit, the guard comes up this way, doesn't he? Wait here in the dark and get him from behind. But if I was hiding that corner, he might have just walked into me and noticed me. There's the bakery, but it's the dairy shop we need. Say again. Hello. <laughs> God damn it. Garrett, can't you mantle when I want you to? Christine's Bakery, I can actually read the sign, okay. Well. Don't come here. Hmm. Did I see something? I hope not. Because then you might have to report it. And I might get in trouble. This is a fish shop. Well, I can't get in there. Herbs and spices. Oh, I don't think anyone's going to find you there. Even if you're not in the dark. And the fish shop needs a key. The uh, vegetable shop. Grocery. That's the one. I going to say green grocers, but it looks more like as much orange and purple grocers as well. And white grocers. Multicolored grocers. Let's rob them for all they're worth. Let's hope they've got colors of gold and silver in here. Copper. Yeah, I guess selling vegetables is not the uh, most remun uh, remunerative, that's the word. Remunerative pr profession. I should say that's the market. Too much coffees. That's the name of the cafe. All right, well, we've got a lot more uh, little houses and shops here to rob. Shops, I guess they are, not houses, mostly. Parcels to deliver and the Hammerite Temple to get to. But uh, that will wait till the next episode. So thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you then.